Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you all so much for joining me today. I hope you guys are having the most wonderful day. Um, guys, so I'm doing another round of the 999 Knockout HMV boxes. Uh, the first set uh, set of boxes that I bought quite, actually quite some time ago were not fantastic. Um, I had heard on the um, HMV grapevine that these boxes were better quality. You were getting better value. They weren't putting in those stupid paper posters and those reflective cards, which I just thought were awful. Um, I never used them. I never kept them. Um, but I've heard that these boxes are well worth the $9.99. Um, so I bought a couple of these boxes. Another video will be up. I will try to link it in the in the description. If it's not in the description yet, it will be put in the description when I've uploaded that version. But this is the blue version of the 999 knockout box. It says that there is a five item minimum and that the Amazon value for the entire box is $24.99. So we should get uh we should get 15 pounds worth of added value. Well, let's be the judge of that, shall we? Um, I love the boxes. I do think that these are actually really cute. And when you go to the, the, the store, I bought these ones online, but when you do go to the store, they really stand out. Um, so we're going to go ahead and open up our box. And the first thing that I see is this box. This is is another, this, we got Ingle, Ingle Moss um, figurines in the last one. So this is another Inger Mills um, figurine, but it is Marvel. So let's see who we got. I don't know who this guy is. I mean, I'm a real Marvel fan, um, but I don't know who this guy is. We don't get anything oh, inside the box to tell us who he is. If you guys know, please let me know in the comment section below. So he looks kind of like an animal. He's dressed in like animal pattern clothing. He has a spear. He has what looks like a machete. Um, beard. Let's see if I can get this out of this package in. So you guys can get a better look. Scissors at this point would always be exceptionally handy, but for some reason, I never bring scissors with me. Oh, let's see if we can get this off. It's, it is taped, and I guess it's taped for um, protection, which is always good. Oh, but we were able to get the little figure out. Oh, very lightweight, actually, very, very lightweight. Oh, this tells me who this guy is. This is, is it Craven the Hunter? Craven the Hunter. Um, it says uh, 8224. So it looks like it's labeled. So we have, is it Craven the Hunter? I think so. If I'm not saying that right, please forgive me. I'm not really familiar with this character. Um, I do believe that I saw something similar about this character, that there may be a movie coming out this year or next year. I'm not sure, but that's actually not a bad little figurine. Um, I really, really like it. And now I know who the guy is. I will go back and research him and find out about him. I'm going to pop him right back inside without, without breaking him. Because he is really, really cute. So, this is one of the first Anger Moss or Ingle Moss, Eagle Moss. What are they? Eagle Moss figurines that I've got that I actually like. So, I'm really, really happy with that. Would I say that's probably worth couple of pound three four probably i'm gonna put this at about four pound so that's pretty awesome we've got we've got the <laughs> normal keychains um every single box i have ever bought from hmv always has a keychain uh always has a keychain this one is uh, marvel's uh avengers infinity wars and this keychain is off thanos's glove um, which I really, really love. Um, it's got all of the um, the stones, which are infinity stones, which are really cute and adorable. This isn't a bad little keychain. I'm happy that it's Marvel and I'm happy to have it. Um, so this little keychain is probably worth about £3. I would say in total so far, we've probably got about £7 worth of our money back. And guys, if I didn't tell you this box was... Um, I did order other stuff when I was buying this box. If you purchase from HNV and it's over £20, you get free shipping. So each one of these boxes cost me £10 flat, which is the same as going to um, which is the same as going to a shop to buy it. So the next thing that we've got 
is a Big Bang Theory coaster. Of course we do. So this coaster is a wee bit weird in the fact that it only has the three guys on it. Um, we're missing Sheldon, Leonard. Oh my gosh, it's been a long time since I've watched The Big Bang. I'm trying to think who we're missing. Raj. So we don't have Raj on this coaster and we have none of the girls on this coaster, which is really, really weird. Um, yeah, I find that really strange. Um, still like it. Still a nice coaster. Is it worth a, probably a pound? That's what I would pay for it. I don't know about you guys. I'm going to say we've probably about eight pounds worth of stuff. <laughs> I got some Pac-Man stickers. So this is Pac-Man and the Ghostly Adventures. Apparently there are 208 stickers to collect in the um, series. We're just, I'm not going to collect these stickers. I certainly am not. So let's go ahead and open these um, and see what they look like on the inside. Okay, let's Try not to destroy them, though. Okay, so we have... I'm not a real Pac-Man fan, so you guys, if there are names for any of these guys, please let me know in the comments section below. Um, So we have this guy. And these are cute, um, actually adorable stickers. We have this person. We have... I know what these are, so I'm definitely okay with those. This one. Oh, we should go this way. And then we have this one. So in total, we get one, two three whoa one two three four five stickers and that's not bad um i probably will put these in a little um thank you bag um just to say thank you when anybody purchases from my vintage or my ebay um so they're pretty neat um what else do we have so we have four items so far and there's still two in there so i got more than five in this one. First time i have ever got more than five items in one of these knockout mystery boxes so i'm actually quite impressed i would say so far these stickers i mean maybe i'm being cheap but i would say these are probably only worth a pound um or even a pound but we'll put them at a pound i would say we've probably got eight pounds worth of merchandise so far if you guys think i'm being a little cheap let me know in the comment section i don't think that they're worth more than that i guess i don't Okay, something I know very little about is Warhammer. This is Warhammer Age of Sigmar. Um, it's champ it's a champions the trading card game. Um, this is a champion deck order. I don't know the value of this at all, but I do know Warhammer can be expensive. I mean, I wouldn't probably put this at more than is £10 putting this too high? I think I'm gonna go with £10 because I do see Warhammer things and I know they're expensive. I'm going to go with 10 for now. If you think I'm being a little cheap or a little too um, high on the price, let me know. Um, I'd be super, super interested. So inside this pack, you're getting uh, the 38 card army, the 13 card booster, uh, the order exclusive card. Um, you're getting the campaign mat, health counters and a detailed rule sheet. Um, so this is... I mean, I'm assuming if you have this, you're kind of ready to go. I don't know. Let me know in the comment section. So I'm going to put this at £10 and I'm going to say that we maybe have £18 worth of stuff. I think even as it stands right now that we've probably made our money back for the £10. Even if I'm being a little bit too, if I'm overpricing things or underpricing them, I still think we've made our £10 and we still have one, still have one item to go. So let's have a look at what that item is. What is this? It looks, it feels like a book. It's probably a diary or calendar. We always get a diary or calendar. It is not. It is a Star Wars, The Last Jedi model, book and model. Actually, guys, do these have any prices? None of these have prices, not one of them. So I'm not even um, able to tell you what the retail price is. Does this? This one does. So this one is $8.99. So almost all the value of this box is here. So everything else is probably, I mean, we definitely made more than our £10, so I'm very, very happy. But to get back to this item, this is a Star Wars The Last Jedi book and model. It says make your own silencer and it's Disney affiliated. This is a licensed Disney product. It says join the dark side with Kylo Ren and Kylo, Kylo Ren and learn about his new, sh new ship from The Last Jedi. Meet new characters, revisit old heroes, and discover the vehicles from the new movie. Then build your own TIE 
silencer model and it, this is the actual size of the model so what do we get inside we get the book which is here can this book come out oh, I think this book is no this book is attached so this book gives you a little bit of information and then I think also the instructions to build your um your is it a silencer is that what they said? Yeah, Thai silencer. And then over here, you have all of the foam parts to make your actual um, little ship. So I think that's pretty neat. All in all, do I think this box was worth it? I sure do. Is this box an improvement on the last boxes they have? Oh, by miles. I have got stuff here that I know I may not use, but I know people who will. Um, I think it was definitely a bargain for the money that I paid for it. Love getting free shipping. Love, love, love getting free shipping. Um, and I think overall, absolutely worth it. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments section. Guys, thank you so much for watching um, this video. Thanks for taking the time. If you wouldn't mind, I'd love if you could like this video. And also, if you're watching and you're not subscribed, I would very, very kindly ask you to subscribe. It really does help out my channel. It is small and I'm still trying to grow it. So any help that you guys can give me, I am so appreciative. Um, I really hope that you all have the most wonderful day. Please stay, stay safe. Please take care. And I will catch you next time. Bye, everyone. Bye.